everybody, it's Duffy, and this is a special Laconia Motorcycle Week preview edition. A um, lot happening, so let's get right to it. People are already starting to roll into Laconia. The vendors are there. The tents are up. Stuff's already starting to happen. Uh, so why don't we get right to it? Let's start with the Tower Hill Tavern. Great, great place. So legendary location when you go to Motorcycle Week. Has one of the best views. Um, the upstairs area of the Tower Hill Tavern um, has a great, great view looking down on the strip there. Um, you know, and uh, just a fantastic location. Anthony has expanded the location, really. If you haven't been there in a couple of years, he's really expanded it and improved the location. He's got the sidecar bar there and the side of the Tower Hill Tavern, obviously the lower area, and the ups, ups, upstairs has bands, great, great location. Then he's got the Sucker Punch Saloon behind, which is kind of like an outdoor patio space. He's also purchased a property a couple doors up um, called the Big House. And that's got a great, great indoor music space. And it's also got an outdoor patio area. So that is definitely one of the places you've got to check out. But why don't we just get the lowdown from Anthony himself, the owner of the Tower Hill Tavern. Alexa, play Robert Duffy and the Four Skins. <laughs> hey. Is that, that on? That was the <laughs> view, yeah. <laughs> it, it must be a very big file. Uh, it's a big file. <laughs> what do you got going for Bike Week this year? Bands. Bands. How many? Lots of bands. Lots of stages. What, what, what's going on at the Tower Hill? We have bike five week? stages. Five stages. Yeah, and we have we have over eighty bands for Motorcycle Week. I think about that it should be good. And you got like one of the best views in Laconia, right? This is great. This is the looking at the strip. This from is the up center. There. This is the center of Motorcycle Week, as far as I'm concerned. This is a great spot. Well, I'm really yeah. looking forward to it. Between here and the high octane, this is probably the the most happening area for Motorcycle Week. You got the loony bin up the street, yep. which is awesome. Who else you got? That's really it. All right. And, you know, thanks to Charlie and uh, Charlie Sinclair and Jen Anderson for hosting us for this wonderful event. We have a great time. Are we going to have centerline parking this year? Do you know? We are. Centerline parking? As far as I'm, as I know, they had it last year. Okay. They didn't, you know, no, no. Back to normal? Issue. I haven't seen, I haven't heard anything otherwise. All right. So it should be good. Good to see you, brother. Looking I'll talk to you soon. All right. Okay. At the other end of the boulevard down in the Weirs, you know, where the sign is, where the Weirs Beach sign is, and the, the location where the former roadhouse used to be um, is now going to be the Chop Chop Beer Tent. Now, the Chop Shop is a local bar in Seabrook, New Hampshire. Um, everyone around here knows the Chop Shop. It's a great location down at the beach. And last year, Billy set up a beer tent up there. And this year, he's doubling his space up there. So that's going to be another great, great location to check out. Why don't we take, take a look at some footage from last year? Hi, Sam here. Carrie here. Um, come see us at our beer tent in Laconia. We're located right across from the Where's Beach sign. We're going to be here all week, the 11th through the 20th. Make sure you come down. Come visit your chop shop, girls.
All right, again, the Chop Shop. Love the people at the Chop Shop. A lot of fun, so definitely check out the Chop Shop while you're there. Tons of booths um, and food and other stuff in that part of uh, the Weirs right across um, from the Boardwalk uh, Cafe restaurant there. Um, right across from the Weirs Beach sign. There's a whole bunch of booths, so it's a lot of fun. So if you go up the hill past Cumbies um, a little ways, on the left is the Looney Bin. Another place you got to check out when you're in town for Motorcycle Week is the Looney Bin. Really, really legendary place. A lot of locals come here. Great, great food. Um, it's meticulously clean. Michelle has a really, really clean kitchen. Um, really small inside, but they have a nice patio area up back. So there's plenty of room out back. There's always a band playing out there. And, you know, always a bunch of, you know, biker-friendly places. They have stuff for you to put down your kickstand. And they have a brand new parking area. So uh, come check out the Looney Bin. Okay, a little pro tip. The food during bike week is very expensive and the quality can be a little sketchy, right? You know, they sell this like meat on a stick and you don't know how long that meat has been hanging on that stick. But the fun spot, um, which is uh, a great, great arcade, it's one of the biggest arcades in the world, has a bunch of classic video games. But the other thing it has is really good pizza for a reasonable price. So if you just want to get a good pizza for not too much money, check out the fun spot. And just down the street from the Looney Bin and the Fun Spot is the High Octane Saloon. Now, it's the location that used to be the Broken Spoke. So people remember the Broken Spoke. Um, Jay Allen founded the Broken Spoke here, Daytona, and in Sturgis. Um, the Turner family has been managing the Broken Spoke for a couple years, and they bought it last year. So the Broken Spoke is now the High Octane Saloon. But I don't know if you used to remember, during bike week, uh, this is, they moved the tent from over there on the left, and now they have the tent here. So the setup's gonna be very similar to what it was when the broken spoke was here. So the servers are all gonna be up here in a platform, and then there's gonna be bands all around here. So it's gonna be a, a similar setup to what we had back when the broken spoke owned it. So um, this is gonna be kind of the outdoor bar setup uh, at the High Octane Saloon. And the big thing is this year there was some confusion. Last year they, there was um, a fee to park during the first weekend of Bike Week. There will be no fee to park, free parking at the High Octane Saloon, the former Broken Spoke. So again, free parking at the High Octane Saloon. Come on down. Um, definitely another one of the really must stops during Motorcycle Week. How you doing? Again, um, free parking uh, at the um, High Octane Saloon. I know there was last year there was some paid parking for the first weekend, but that is not the case. There's free parking all week long at the High Octane Saloon. They're going to have stuff going on all week. Um, I'll be in and out of there all week. Uh, the Turners are great people. Um, I'll be doing updates. I'll give you guys updates on what bands are playing at the High Octane Saloon every night. Um, so just stay tuned for that. I'll, again, I'll be doing live updates, you know, probably every other day or uh, if every day if I can, depending on the internet signal up there um, during the rally, to keep you guys updated on what's going on. And if you go right down the way um, towards the Harley-Davidson dealer, um, past the High Octane Saloon, you might want to check out the Twin Barns. It's, a, it's at the location that used to house um, the Police Motorcycle Museum, and it's kind of like a local beer brewery. It got, you know, a nice outdoor space um, worth checking out it, you know, if you want to grab a beer, get something to eat. And uh, that's really about it. I mean, I'm not saying these are the only places in Motorcycle Week, but these are just kind of places that I've selected for my preview. Hope you guys all have fun this week. And definitely get on, you know, get out to the track in Loudoun. You know, just get on 106 and head out. It's not even a half an hour drive. There are ton, tons of vendors out there. There's racing all week. Um, and even if you don't go to one of the big races, just go check it out um, and support local racing. Um, there are amateurs racing out there all week. There are professionals racing out there all week. There's tons of vendors. There's demo rides. If you want to try out a motorcycle, you can do that out at the track. Um, you know, there's vendors who come from all over, like Amsol Bob, you know, who followed him on YouTube driving up. Um, so, you know, show some love to those vendors. Go out there and check them out and have a good time. And I look forward to seeing everyone up in Laconia. Oh! <laughs>